So I'm going to go over the process I used to create curved tunnels or curved hallways inside of Unity using Pro Builder. So first thing I'm going to do is create a new shape. I have an arch here selected, so these are my current settings. I'm going to hold left shift and just place this first shape right here. I'm going to select the faces on this side. I'm going to hold left shift and drag out with the mouse. Make sure you have center pivot mode selected so you can drag it from the center point. I'm going to create another section and this will be rotated. Now, we should be able to extrude out but it's not following our direction right so we need to fix that. Let's go to the orientation in the Pro Builder menu. I'm going to switch it to normal. Then I'm going to extrude out. And then I'm going to rotate again. Then I'm going to extrude out and rotate. So just keep doing that until you reach the curved section you want. So now that we have a curve here, I'm going to go over the other process you can use to do the same exact thing. So let's say we have our selection here. Now we extrude out. Let's go to, I can even switch this back to global. And we can see here we have extrude faces. We can press the plus button and we can see it's set to face normal. Now we can choose whatever distance we want. So two is fine for now. I'm going to extrude and then I'm going to rotate just a little bit. Extrude, rotate a little bit, extrude, rotate a little bit, extrude. Just keep going. And we can see we are creating a very nice uniform curve. So, of course, our textures look very strange right now. Our UVs are all over the place. Um, there is a quick fix I use. First, I'm going to select the faces. And under the Pro Builder menu, you can see we have UV Editor. And we open that up. We can convert to normal for the UV mode. And we can either choose planar, and it'll look like that, which sometimes gives pretty good results. Or we can also use box. And this also gives pretty decent results. So now what we can do is fix our lighting because we can see we apply a white material. Sorry, if we apply a white material, we can see that does not look very good. We have shadows all over the place here. So how do we fix that? A very easy fix is to select our faces. just going to show you on this first section here. Make sure you have all of the even amount of faces. And now we can go to the Pro Builder menu and we do merge faces. And now we can see we have a much nicer, much smoother hallway thanks to our UV being fixed. Let's also merge these faces and we can see without how much of a difference this makes see here if we merge over here these two sections don't quite line up you can't really tell now because we have the shaded mode but you can see the seam there so what you can do is actually combine these two sections so merge faces again it does fix a little bit it's not going to be perfect but for the most part it does a pretty decent job See, we can move the lights outside the wall here. So if we throw some light there, it doesn't look too bad. In comparison to this. So we can create some very nice smooth tunnels or hallways. And hopefully this was um, useful to you. Leave a like, subscribe, all that. Thank you.